What's up, everybody? I'm here live with Bill Somerville with Dawn Patrol Digital. So excited to have you on here, Bill. What's going on, man? Nothing much, man. Just uh, hanging out. It's another beautiful day in, uh, in South Florida. We're all stoked, and uh, it's, it's great, man. What's going on with you? Yeah, life is good. Life is good. Just this, this series has been super fun, you know, just continuing the 12 days, or we're calling it St. Nick's 12 Days of Mortgage Giveaways. So it's been, uh, it's been cool. So yeah, day four today, um, for anybody, as you get on here, don't forget comment a number one to a hundred in the comments. Uh, today, what we're going to give away is a YouTube branding pack. All right. So, um, my designer charges $300 for these and what it costs, it's well, two two ninety seven 297, something like that. Right. But we'll just say 300. And, uh, what that includes is your YouTube header graphic, your profile photo, um, a video intro that like has your logo spinning or whatever, you know, that fancy stuff people have on the beginning of their videos. Um, and then also an ending screen that you can use on all your videos. It has all your compliance information and that kind of thing. So you never have to worry about saying it, right? If you're a loan officer or a realtor or insurance agent, you can have all that stuff on the back end. So comment one to a hundred and we're going to pick that. Uh, we're going to use the random number generator to pick the winner as soon as after Bill gives us this awesome tip he was just talking about around, uh, around using Instagram hashtags. So cool, man. Well, uh, yeah, this is awesome. Even I haven't, I haven't heard this tip, so I'm really excited to hear uh, exactly what it's going to be. So you want to dive into it? Yeah, man. I, first I want to tell you this is that, uh, so today I had uh, a good buddy of mine, uh, that, uh, that just finished up, uh, college, got his degree. And, uh, last night, like I knew it was going to be a semi-formal event and, uh, you know, I, do my routine and I, I pull out the trimmers to get the beard and I'm like I got it on it's coming for the beard and I was just like I got this Facebook live with Nick Carpenter tomorrow like I can't <laughs> I, can't, I, I gotta I gotta let it go like I can't come on there looking all clean shaven and this guy's got this Saint Nick beard I'm like it's not gonna work so I want <laughs> you to know that that was like that was part of it like last night I was like nope stop so <laughs> love that but yeah, man, ha hashtags. Uh, I know that you know most people will know um, what a, what a hashtag is. It's like a, basically like a, a, a tracking uh, metric where uh, on sites like Instagram, uh, you put like you know hashtag loan officer or hashtag insurance agent, and uh, you can actually click on hashtag, and all the different users that are using this hashtag will come up with their pictures. Uh, how do you take advantage of this? Right, good question. So for loan officers, uh, I know one of the big pain points is always like networking with, with realtors and, and other guys in the space. So if you know, for instance, let's say um, like you know that there's a conference coming up or, or you know that there's some big event, what you can use is use those hashtag events uh, and uh, search the, the hashtag. So if you're in Instagram, you go down to the bottom, it's like a little magnifying glass if, if you're on your phone app. Uh, and you can click that and the uh, first thing uh, or the second thing I believe that comes up, um, if you look up at the top, there's it's people, uh, it's tags, it's location. Uh, there's a few different options. You want to click on tag and you want to put on that, that hashtag and it's going to basically show, you know, all these pictures uh, that are popping up from uh, all these industry leaders and what that can do for you is a couple things. So now you can see who's posting, who's active on social media. Uh, you can see you know, what conferences they're going to, uh, if they're selling houses, it's a very popular thing for both loan officers and realtors. Like if, if they sell a house, they issue a loan, uh, they're going to, you know, put a hashtag on it and say, Hey, another, another client helped gives you a, a good idea about production as well. Um, obviously everybody wants to work with like the guys that are doing a lot of business. So you right. see something that's posted over and over again, you know, the guy he's putting out on social media, he's, he's probably doing pretty good. Uh, so it, it can, it can give you a segue into an opening conversation. Hey, saw that you were at so-and-so conference. How did it go? Just quick, short message or email, uh, especially if they have a business page, there's usually a lot of information up on their Instagram business page, like phone number, cell phone number, like all different kinds of data. Uh, two websites that I wanted to mention, uh, righttag.com and also best hyphen hashtag.com. So these are sites that are going to allow you to, to hack the hashtag game. Uh, I thought there was some really interesting insight. Like right before I came on, uh, I did a search for on best hashtags.com, uh, best, sorry, hyphen hashtags.com of what kind of hashtags that, uh, realtors are using and also which ones they like the most. So the ones that they're using, not usually going to be a surprise, uh, you know, uh, property, you know, helping people get homes, you know, hashtag 
whatever um, in, in the real estate industry. But hashtags that are most liked by realtors is what was really interesting to me on that. And one of the top ones, hashtag Bitcoin. Who would have thunk it, right? I, I wouldn't, but let's say, you know, if you know that your target market audience is liking hashtags like that a lot and searching hashtags, it's a great way to just throw a hashtag Bitcoin in there and all of your hashtags, most people won't even notice it, but if a realtor is, you know, late at night, they're checking out their Bitcoin and probably crying themselves to sleep because they bought it at 20 grand and it's at like $4 right now. Uh, you know, you as, as a mortgage officer will like pop up, you know, and you can make a funny joke. They probably won't laugh at it. Like, Hey, lose a lot of money in, in, in Bitcoin. Like, you know, get it back by making a, a referral connection with the best loan officer in the country or in the state. So an idea that you can definitely use. And then uh, for putting your own hashtags on there, uh, righttag.com. All right, it's gonna show you uh, at the top, there's a search uh, to the far upper right of the web page. You'll see uh, a little tab that says tags. You can put something in there um, like, uh, you know, mortgage loan officer, uh, realtor, whatever you want. And, uh, you know, it's going to give you a list of hashtags that you can use for immediate growth. Uh, and longer term hashtags too, that if you continually post them, you'll get more and more traction. So really simple tr uh, trick. I'm sure I'm not surprising anyone uh, by mentioning the word hashtag, but I, I always saw them on images. And for, for a while, it's just like, you know, this is obnoxious. There's a lot of hashtags. What's the point of this? Uh, and then I found out that people were, were leveraging these hashtags um, to make connections and to generate business out of it. And, uh, it, it's an awesome hack. Uh, I highly suggest it if you're a loan officer to use it. Um, and that's the, that's what I'm going to give away to you guys. Awesome. That's awesome, yeah. man. Yeah. You know, uh, just hearing you think about that. It, it, well, one idea that came to my mind too is for local events, right? Is like a way that you can go in and use the local hashtags and find people in your local area. So if you're a realtor, insurance agent, loan officer, you know, you're trying to get a bunch of local people connected with you on Instagram. That'd be another way to do it too, you know, is look at what local hashtags are being used um, and also to establish yourself, you know, as a local expert. So if people are, are searching even those local hashtags, you know, your, your photos are coming up inside of those hashtag searches because, yeah, man, sometimes people get lost in those kind of a rabbit hole, right, of like hashtag rabbit hole. <laughs> it gets crazy. And one of the other search features besides tags is uh, is, uh, is uh location, right? So you can actually go to the location uh, in the search for Instagram. Uh, it just queues up at the top, you know, like nearby stuff. You click it and you can just see like everything, right? Like me being in South Florida, the two most popular things um, are fitness models and, and realtors. Like that's just it. Like I go to like, you know, like uh, Boynton or, or Boca and it's just like, you just, just down, you know, and uh, it, it's great. It's a great uh, networking tool. Uh, another popular thing too is is like chamber of commerce uh, meetings. Uh, there's uh, uh, like B and I groups, like stuff like that. That I know that the the loan officers um, and the realtors both love that, and uh, insurance agents too. Um, they'll they'll all love that stuff. So it's a great way. I, I'm always a big fan. You always hear me talk and I'm always talking about like how can I do the least amount of work and like get the most out of it like that's always like what's going on you know in, in my busy head and and for me like utilizing it and leveraging those hashtags it's just it, it makes life so much easier so yeah for sure and yeah. especially you know, what's cool is now that Instagram has the whole private messaging side you know where I mean you can see when people are active on Instagram the same way you can see when people are active on Facebook mm -hmm. so it's pretty cool too where you can you know, you can keep that, keep it on Instagram, right? If the people are obviously on Instagram, they're, you know, active on that platform instead of trying to go and like source them out somewhere else, just shoot them a message right there on Instagram. Super easy. Sure. Awesome, man. And some people are, are vested to a particular like social media distribution network. Like there are guys that are on Facebook and that's, that's really all they do. And, and there are guys on Instagram. I know guys on Instagram that don't have, have uh, Facebook uh, profiles. I know, uh, there are guys um, uh, on YouTube, right? Um, they're, they're YouTube guys. Uh, they're, right. so it really just depends in like having, uh, having something that, you know, you can kind of do on, on the Facebook side, on the Instagram side, and on the YouTube side is just, it, it's huge, you know, because yeah, you could totally. be a, a ton of business uh, and a ton of referral partnerships. Like 
uh, out there because you know you're leaving one um, one out of the mix. So yep, you know something. Awesome, to think yeah. So let me. Uh, all right. So that that was a great. That was definitely a great tip. I love that. And if you guys don't aren't familiar with Bill, Bill's a former Na um not Navy. That's funny. Bill's a former Army officer. Now he runs one of the <laughs> best insurance agent uh, marketing companies. And what's cool about Bill is he actually does it at least that I'm aware of completely different than anybody else in the insurance space because everybody else is out there trying to get insurance leads and bill figure helps you get referral partners and using home buyer leads and a little bit different strategy. And it's an, it's an epic strategy. So if you're an insurance agent watching this, definitely connect with bill and, and see if he's got some space, you know, where, wherever you're at. Um, awesome. Cool. Bill, if somebody wants to get in contact with you, is there uh, other than just finding on Facebook, is there a better way to connect with you? Yeah, so Facebook is always uh, going to be the easiest way. Uh, there's there's also our website www.dawnpatroldigital.com uh, is the other one. Uh, Instagram. There's too many ways to get a hold of me. I'm trying to fix that. <laughs> okay, good enough. I like it. Awesome, man. Well, thank you so much for coming on here today and sharing your tip uh, with your Instagram hashtags. And thank you so much, Bill, for coming on here today. Really appreciate that and joining me for Saint Nick's. 12 days of giveaways. It's been awesome. Thanks for having me, man. I really appreciate it. All right, man. I'll talk to you later on. See you. Sounds good. Later, guys.